Hello friends, hope you are all doing good. I'm back with another video and this time I'm doing video for thumbnails. Specifically somebody left a comment asking me how I'm putting shadows on the text on my thumbnails in my last two videos. So let me zoom here and show you and then you can see closely. So on my last two videos I tried something to make even better thumbnails. I started putting shadow behind the text. So uh, I just thought you know do a short video on this request like to show you how so basically what I'm using is I'm using a website called canva.com while I'm going there and I'm about to show you how I do it I would really appreciate if you give me a thumbs up on this and subscribe to my channel so all right so this is canva.com here you can come and on the left side they have this menu I keep all my designs here I use it, this for my both YouTube channel art and also for my thumbnail so here you see this icon so I just showed you this one and this is where I just um, so basically what I do is I take a picture and put text on it with some shadow so it makes it make it look nice it gives you a context to users so I just copied it to show you how I'm doing it basically I always keep a picture behind it but to make it easy for this video I'm just gonna delete the picture and then just show you the text so it is easier for you to understand so let's now go to the left menu bar where you can actually select different type of fonts so let's take heading and let's say you know type something something like as awesome shadows I think that will be a good example to explain you how I am adding shadows so then all you have to do is take it drag it where you want to keep it then copy it and paste it yes that's the trick and then you have to go and leave the first color as black but for this new one pasted you change the color let's say I change here to green and then first of all try to bring it exactly on top of it and then after that you start moving with your arrow keys which side you want shadow so typically what I do is I move it little bit left uh, I move few clicks left and few clicks up and now you can see it has started showing as a shadow so that's the trick that I'm using to make these new thumbnails and that I have actually you know really helped me so I just thought to share this idea so let's copy paste it and create another one to show you so I copied it I'm dragging in I'm just gonna select the top one and change its color let's say this time to yellow again now you can see with with the same uh, if you just have the one color but if you copy paste and you know have the shadow so what I'm now doing is copying in copying the just the original text without the shadow so you, you to show you guys difference so you can already see with and without shadows how much difference uh, it is so I, I just thought to share this idea and you know this is really something cool and somebody asked me for it so I thought to do a video so thank you so much for watching if you have any other question or you want to know about anything else from my channel or you you have you have any other suggestion you need from me please leave a comment i do appreciate all your, all your comments i will definitely make a video on that all right my dear friends thank you so much for, uh, for watching this video i'll call this as awesome shadows video all right until then see you in next video thank you